Yo, yo, yo. I'm back. I'm back. So today I'm going to show you how I do my game staging. I'm not going to waste your time. Um, So let's work. All right. We, I usually start with my kick. I solo my kick. And see where it's hitting. Minus two. I need it to be at negative six. Negative six, then I'll just I'll just um gain stage everything around the kick. See how I'm using the, the knobs up there? There's an input gain knob. Um, if yours is not showing, you just go to the wrench right here and turn it on. Input control right here. All right. Um, so we're going to go one by one. The reason I'm using the input gain knob is for later on when I add effects and all that stuff, I have more control over the... Um, the volume faders. All right, so uh, let's finish this. All right, so once I'm done here, what I usually do, actually, what I usually do is I'll go with the 808. So with the 808, actually with the 808 and the kick, usually want I don't want to be around like negative three together, which sounds good right here. Um, and then when I have these two together, I'll go, I'll find my main sound in my melody. So for the lead, I'll start with the lead since that's my main um, mel melody that's playing throughout the track. So we're going to see how it sounds against the kick. All right. So once we get the main one, we're going to solo we're going to take off the kick and we're going to take the rest of the melody. We're going to We're going to go against this. For this one, I had lowered the fader, so we're going to put it back at 0. This one too. All right, so we're gonna start with this.
This is, was supposed to be just for like a background noise, that synth. So we're gonna duck it in the background and then we're gonna solo the next one. The next sound. See how it sounds against the kick. So, alright, so we're gonna unsolo everything, see how it sounds. I think it might, it might be a little bit uh, low right now, but you want everything to be low during your game staging. Because when you mix, you want everything to be at a low volume. You don't want to mix at a high volume. Then you're going to get confused. You want a low volume so you can hear everything. And plus, it's good for your ears so you don't get tired so easily. Just going to raise it for now. Just comments, likes, subscribe, thank you.